Hello guys, Solitaire Gamer here, and today I'll be reviewing Food Wars Shokugeki no Soma Season 1. When people think of great anime that has amazing food in it, they think of this anime first, for good reasons too. The food in the show looks so good, and the reactions that the characters have are so hilarious that it makes you want to try that dish yourself. In this anime, Soma has been working at a diner called Yukihira for a while, but his father decides to close down the diner for now and have him go to a cooking school in order to improve his cooking skills even more. At this school, Soma not only makes friends and rivals, but he must also make dishes that he never tried making before. It was entertaining seeing him rise up to challenge and not being afraid. The food in this anime looks so amazing. It makes you really wish you had that dish in real life. That steak rice bowl that someone made looks so good. That was my favorite dish in the show. Everything from the steak to the onions to the rice to the sauce looks so tasty. I never really paid much attention to food during anime, but I couldn't keep my eyes off, that, off of that dish. The curry rice omelette he made at the end of season 1 looked so nice as well. I liked how the characters went into detail on how they made their dishes such as the ingredients and the methods of making the dish. It makes the dish even tastier. There are several shows out there that is also about cooking as well, but what separates this show from other cooking anime shows is the over the top reactions. The characters in the show are so passionate about cooking. For them it is life and death. Cooking means everything to them. Seeing characters this passionate about cooking makes you even more excited about seeing the dishes they made. The way the show suddenly shows the guys and girls stripping clothes and climaxing after eating a dish makes for a hilarious scene. I laughed so much at their over the top reactions. They looked like they were in pleasure. Not only is it funny, it made me hungry as well and I wanted to try the dish myself. There was actually a video of people making the dishes that were in Shokugeki no Soma in real life. The dishes look so great in real life. The over the top reactions also made for great etchy scenes because all the girls in the show were really hot with big breasts so see them naked like that was great. The characters were enjoyable to watch for the most part. The three characters that got most screen time this season were Megami, Soma, and Erina. Soma had a very likable personality as he is always confident. Even if he loses to someone over 100 times he still won't give up on making a better dish than them. He doesn't let anyone talk badly about him or his friends. His ambition to be the best chef is what really got me to like him as a character. Erina is a generic tsundere. She always acts rude towards Soma, and some people hate her for that. I like her though because she made for a great villain and kept motivating Soma to become better by continuing to taunt him. Soma wouldn't be the chef he is now without her help. Megami is a standard nice girl who always tries her best. I've seen that type of character many times in anime. She was still enjoyable to watch though because of the amazing character development she got during the show. She went from a shy girl who wasn't confident about her cooking to a confident girl who knew she could make amazing dishes and make her family and friends proud. The two openings for this anime was decent but nothing that special. I really liked the first ending of the show though. It was a really catchy song. The second ending was not as good. The music during the episodes made me even more excited to see the characters make amazing dishes. The animation style was great. The food looked so tasty. The animation was good for the most part. I didn't notice any animation errors. I definitely recommend this anime to anyone who really likes food. This anime has the tastiest dishes you'll ever see. The over the top reactions that the characters have about the dishes makes you want to eat the dishes even more. I give this anime a 8 out of 10. So that's all I want to talk about for today. Thank you for watching this video. Have a great day or night wherever you are. And please like and subscribe if you enjoy the video. And please comment if you found anything interesting in the video.